Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for being here. I hope everyone is doing well at home. Um, today I wanted to just do a fun random look. Showed you guys how I do winged liner, skirt up a little bit, um, lashes, and I threw kind of this red color on my bottom lids. Delish Dean on Instagram, I follow her. She, she's a celebrity makeup artist. She did like an orange look like this, so I thought it'd be fun to play with some color. Yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe, stay tuned, and yeah. <laughs> the MAC Paint Pot. And then take a little bit of the Camo Concealer from e.l.f. Just kind of patting that out. I'm gonna take da, 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 like a fluffier face brush, but I'm gonna go into my Wet and Wild. Also, don't judge me. I had to clip my nails off. So there's that. I'm just kind of lightly patting this over to start. When I start the eyeshadow. It won't skip. It'll kind of glide better. All right, so I'm really into this look from Delish Dina. It's kind of just very simple on her top lids with eyeliner, lashes, and then she really blew out like a bright color on the bottom. I don't think I'm gonna do orange, but I think I wanna do some sort of color. So, let's start with just kind of the top. This is the Mitchell palette. I'm gonna jump into um, Modest. Next, I'm gonna take this little single shadow from NYX. This is Blame It On Midnight. Open. It's a simple nude shade. Kind of just blend over modest. Just stop making faces at the camera. Um, okay, so <clears throat> I'm gonna show you guys how I do eyeliner. Oh, I'm trying not to make a ton of noise, but first, let's put some cream liner. The, I have the Kat Von D cake pencil in black. I'll put this up top.
All right, so I'll put that just up top. Um, now, maybe like prep myself. I haven't done winged eyeliner in a minute and I haven't done it on camera, so I need to adjust myself. I usually do eyeliner before I put all my face on so I can like touch my face, so right now it's a little weird. I'm gonna use the ABH liquid liner. Bear with me, people. I used to do eyeliner like religiously all the time and I had it down packed and now it's it's tough so let's see how this goes to like line my edge first to kind of give myself a wall that we're gonna try and not go down, but we'll see. So basically, go. wow, that actually worked good. I'm trying not to look up so it doesn't go everywhere. Does anyone else hold their breath when they do eyeliner? Doesn't look too bad. Now the other side's probably gonna be an issue. So same thing. This really makes it easy, this product. The wand is so long, so it kind of just drags itself. Bring it in. Okay, before I get too carried away, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so mad. <laughs> I should have let it dry. I screwed it up. It was still wet right there. You see that? No, I'm gonna fix it. 
I'm gonna put a little concealer down. Such an idiot. I got it all over my brush too. Okay, this is how you fix your mistakes. I don't have any liquid like makeup remover or else I'd use that. So basically I'm just concealing over it. break. Just let it dry for a second. Just take a little bit of this and kind of run over it. This is what happen. it happens, it starts to get thicker and thicker. So now I'm really not done. Now I'm done touching it. All right, I think since a lot of the work is gonna be done on the bottom, even though that was a lot of work putting that freaking eyeliner on, I'm gonna do mascara and throw my lashes on now too. Um, Ardell 252. So I just snipped them, put a little glue on, let them dry up. Actually, I'm gonna put them, put this one down, start the other one. I don't know why I'm so quiet today. Like high energy earlier, and then once the camera turns on, I'm like, So bored in my house. When I'm in my house, bored. Alright, so while the second one dries, I think the first one's good. Trick is to let them almost dry all the way. As you can see that little lump that I tried to fix. So for under my eyes, since I'm really gonna pack the color on, I'm lightly taking the MAC Paint Pot, very lightly, I'm not really gonna go crazy, and just kinda like swipe it under here a bit, just to help give me a base for the shadow to really stick better than it would without any sort of base. All over my teeth, that's why I hate this shit. Just a plain brush. Okay. 
So, thinking, I was thinking green at first, but that green is very intense. I was kind of thinking these two colors. But then a part of me is thinking really like hot pink red. Let's go more warm tone. Let's do, let's start out with Mama Mad. In my Valentine, Valentine, in my Valentine's video, I used this um, red shade all over my lid. Very pigmented. Whereas I just like to like pack it on there. Kind of start blending just side to side, keeping it up higher because I'm going to take another shade down below. I'm going to use the same brush. I'm just kind of taking as much of the product off as I can. <sighs> really? I'm going to see what Mr. H does. It's like a peachy coral color. I kind of want to see if that'll show up with it. And if it doesn't, I might mix in this hot pink. Basically same thing, I'm gonna pack it on the brush and just now go slightly lower. It's okay. Now we're really just kind of diffusing that line where it was just red. We wanna soften it up a bit. And you can really do this like with any color. So now I'm going to go back into Mr. H, the red, and up high again, just like pack and sweep it around a little bit. black liner in the inner corner. I have a red liner that would look pretty, but I'm kind of feeling just the black. Okay guys, so this is the final look. Before I fully close out, I wanna um, show you guys what I put on my lips. I have the NYX lip liner in Nude Truffle. And then I did the NYX lip suede. This is the Sandstorm one, I believe. And then I topped it a little bit just now with the Kiko Milano, and this is their lip gloss in Brilliant. I love their packaging, it's super cute. Um, but yeah, so I hope you guys liked this video. I hope um, everyone is doing good, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.